And as Ali mentioned, VI Governor Albert Bryan Jr. is in Washington, D.C. this week, helping to lead discussions on workforce development and meeting with the president and other governors to discuss infrastructure investments and getting people back to work. Our Washington, D.C. correspondent Rachel Knapp caught up with the governor on the policy discussions he's been having in our nation's capital. What discussions um, uh, have you had with uh, other governors and, and uh, you know, policy planning? You know, the, the most important uh, topic of the day is flexibility. Uh, we've been getting a lot of funds, whether through CARES Act, uh, Education, Treasury, the American Recovery Plan. So the flexibility and the dollars to be able to do the things that each one of these governors have that's unique about the economy is what's important. Uh, one of the things that I found out here is that we're so far ahead in terms of our rural broadband uh, piece, in terms of our management of COVID and getting that out. We are far ahead and well-funded uh, for uh, into the future. The president uh, that we met with today, um, his issue, of course, is his Build Back Better plan. He wants to get that out. He wants to recruit us as advocates for that. It is important to us in the Virgin Islands. Um, I think that our infrastructure, especially our roadways, uh, need plenty of work. Um, we could always use the workforce development money because there is so much of that unmotivated workforce that we want to get back involved, especially now at a time in this in our history when there's so many projects going on um, that we need to get done.